Good morning, everybody. Um, I wanted to hop on and give you guys a little update here and then um, share some fun things that have happened recently on the farm. Um, I am still doing well. I had my follow-up with my surgeon um, that did my colon resection and he said everything looks great. I was cleared to eat a normal diet, which was wonderful. Um, since December 11th, I had been on a, a soft food only diet. So I was definitely glad to have uh, normal food back in, in my, my daily routine. Um, but everything looks good there. I just had my port put in uh, yesterday. Today is the 26th of January. So I got that put in, it's on my left side. It's really still pretty sore. So, um, but that's really good. The port, if you aren't familiar with what that is, I had to Google it, but it's basically like a, a permanent device installed under your skin where they can either draw blood or give um, IV medicine. So if you're somebody that's gonna need um, a lot of IV type stuff, for example, a cancer patient, um, that saves the little tiny tender veins in your arms, hands, and wrists um, from, from getting damaged too much. So they can just kind of plug in uh, right to there and it's got a catheter that goes down into um, basically down towards my heart and everything can go in that way so um, it will hopefully make things a lot easier for me as I start to receive treatment we are definitely getting excited it's not the right word but definitely looking forward to my visit to MD Anderson we leave Monday the 29th um, and we'll have several days worth of appointments down there and we'll update you as we can. But for today's video, I thought I would kind of share a little bit just of the family doing fun things. We recently had some really cold, yucky weather come through and everything iced over. So uh, Whitney and the kids decided to take a walk through the ice down to the back pond and see if they could hop up any ducks. Um, Whitney and the boys really love duck hunting. Whitney grew up doing this, I mean, he's since he was 10, 12 years old. So this is a, a really big part of his childhood and something he enjoys sharing and teaching to our kids. Oliver and Parker are just old enough to really start going consistently and Emma's just on the edge of that. So Parker's, the last two years, Parker's been able to shoot, Oliver hasn't yet but I, I would expect next year that probably will change and Ollie will get a turn. Um, but yeah, to, I'm gonna show you a video of them walking down to the back pond or rather sliding down to the back pond. I've got and some really cool still shots that I'll add in there too. We just, our property and the properties that um, we have access to hunting, hunting on, it's just some really beautiful spots. So I thought I'd share a little bit of that with you guys this morning. It's not going to be a super long video like what I usually post, but I did still want to have some content coming out. So I hope you guys enjoy. Thanks for watching. Can you unhook the fence? Go you have to. Okay. Careful with the gun, stay in the grass. Get over on the grass. Parker, get on the grass. The tall grass. Good boy, here. Good boy. 
Bring it to me. Good boy. Come on. Good boy. Drop. Magnificent. Magnificent. Punches. That's a hard Punches. one. Yes. That's his back legs. His his neck, long, he. The climbs.